Hey, I'm Andrew Godsey. Um, I noticed there was a bunch of uh, videos on YouTube that, that had vinyl application, but they were kind of like, they were very commercial, and they were too, too, too much technique, and not very simple to do, especially if you don't have the right chemicals and stuff. So I'm going to make it really simple, like, I have a vinyl logo right here. I'm going to put it on my fridge, figure what the hell I wanted to make the video, put it on my fridge. Um, this is a mistake. <laughs> But, first of all, you just want to take, you want to clean up all the smudges, so, get that, you want no oil from fingerprints or anything on there, but after you clean it, you want to take a microfiber uh, cloth, get rid of all the dust from the towel. You can't take it off the paper, like that, and just slap it on there, you can do that, it's possible. It may not be straight that way, so you're probably gonna gonna want to put it on the right way. <laughs> Line it up where you want. It. You tape it right down the middle. And then you're gonna take your scissors, peel the vinyl back, and you're not gonna do not cut the vinyl. I mean, obviously that's gonna screw it up. So. Cut a little bit of the paper off, and then in the business we use a squeegee. But I mean, probably gonna have that. So when I was missing a squeegee, I just pull up random credit card. And I want to avoid air bubbles, so you're gonna want to go like papers on the bottom, your application points on the top. You're gonna want to go toward the application point and just kind of like go outwards. Now, take the tape off, take the paper backing off, you might end up a little crease there. It's gonna happen sometimes. But just make sure you start the top. You don't wanna start where it's connected, you wanna start at the very top. Go down, just a little bit at a time. Make sure it's all got a good, solid. If you're applying to something that has to be outside where it's cold, like the fridge, fridge, I mean, it's out in the garage, it's cold. And on top of that, I've got a, like a weird, it's got a strange texture to it, like a leather kind of texture to it. You're going to want to uh, take a heat gun to it. Sometimes a hair dryer will do if you don't have a heat gun. And it doesn't need to be like super, super hot. But that kind of helps the, uh, it helps the vinyl kind of adjust. As a like a cheapskate way to make sure the paper's gonna come off and not rip the decal off with it, yeah, soap water. Sounds weird, but it works. Let's see, this will this will cool down the tape, but the back where the vinyl is touching the fridge, that's gonna stay hot. Hopefully that will help. Oh yeah. That helped. Tape, scissors, cleaning cloth, some uh, unnamed cleaning chemical.